Other kin is an umbrella term to any non-human identified person. Other kin means a person who identifies as a non-human animal, creature, being, etc. on an integral and personal level. Other kin are largely identified as, but are not limited to, mythical creatures such as angels, demons, dragons, fairies, griffins, and aliens. Many other kin also believe in the existence of a multitude of parallel and alternate universes and other planets. Therians are considered a branch of the Otherkin community. Therianthrope, or Therian for short, comes from the term Therianthropy, which refers to the metamorphosis of humans into animals, most often depicted by the werewolves in popular Western culture. Although there are numerous examples of mythology around the world that involves many different animals aside from wolves, today, Therian is a term used by people who believe themselves to be partially non human. The first widely known internet use of the term developed among the Usenet group alt.horror.werewolves in 1992 by those who identified as part human. Otherkin also became a widely used term. Therians largely identify as earthly creatures. Examples include, but are not limited to, felines, canines, birds, rodents, reptiles, amphibians, fish, equines, and bovines, both wild and domestic. Dinosaurs and other creatures who are now extinct but once lived on Earth are also included. There are two main branches of beliefs among Therians and other kin as to how this happened, spiritual and psychological. The spiritual side believe it is possible through reincarnation or having a non-human soul in a human body, while the psychological side see it as someone who mentally identifies with a non-human animal, be it to bring comfort to someone or caused by trauma in one's life. Some believe it is a combination of the two. Some believe in the clinical view, which is, one believes that the cause has to do with their brain physically functioning differently than a normal human. A change in the wiring, causing one's brain to sometimes act like that of a non-human animal, or in a way that can be compared to the behavior of a non-human animal. Some think that being Therian or other kin can be caused from a genetic trigger, giving rise to the possibility that it can be hereditary in some cases. There is no conclusive reason yet as to why Therians or other kin exist. Some Therians and other kins use the term species dysphoria to describe their feelings of disconnect with their human bodies or the human race as a result of their identification. Shifting is a common term used by both Therians and other kin. The main branches of shifting are phantom and mental. Phantom shifting is a lot like the phantom limb condition felt by amputees. The most common limbs felt are ears, tails, claws, paws, and fangs. Mental shifting is basically when the mind shifts from human to animal thoughts and is the most common form of shifting. A subbranch of shifting is physical. Physical shifting would be described as changing into an earthly animal or mythological creature, which is mostly seen in movies and television. No confirmed cases of physical shifting have been found, and the majority of the community does not believe it possible to do. Astral and dream shifting are also sub-branches of shifting that are also common. Totemism is often mistaken for being Therian, and vice versa. The difference can be explained as internal versus external. A totem is an external energy, influence, or guide, whereas with a Therian or other kin, energy or influence comes from within. Therian and other kin often refer to what you are within yourself. It is the creature that you are on an inescapable level. It does not change. Totems are separate external entities. In some cases, it can feel like they have a little nest in the back of your head, but their voice and thoughts are not your own. They are usually earth animals and offer advice and guidance. Each animal fits an archetypal mold for their roles and areas of aid. 
for the most part. They tap into the knowledge and lessons of the natural world.